Welcome back guys, Gvids here. Today's video, I'm going to show you guys how we can duplicate our carcasses. Now that is any carcass we want, So, but we do have to be in passive mode for this. So if you guys don't know how to get in passive mode, I'm going to throw a link down in the bottom there so you guys can go watch another video on how to do so, but I'll also explain it briefly as I'm doing it. So what you want to do is click over on your D-pad. If you have no one in your recent players list, go join a showdown and a players list will pop up for you. So you go to recent, you find a name that's online, you click them. Once it starts to join, you wait until it goes gray and you're going to hit that home button. Go to network, dis yourself, disconnect yourself from the internet and then connect back. And then hit, hit your home button once more, bring you back into the game. You're going to see those disconnected um, alerts. Once you see that, you know that's not a big deal. Click yourself back into free roam and everything should be good. Grab yourself a carcass, head on over to Blackwater's Butchers. You want to park your horse right in front of the butcher. Of course, you want your carcass on that horse. So once you parked your horse, you want to get off your horse. You're going to run right into the tailors here. Go all the way into the back to the wardrobe. You're going to enter that wardrobe room. You're going to wait until the settings pop back up. And then you're going to exit that wardrobe room. Go back on outside. And as you just saw there, my carcass just fell right to the ground. My horse is long gone, but my carcass is right there. So we're going to pick up our carcass. And like I, was, like I was saying, it'd be better if you're using a cougar. I didn't have time, so I just grabbed the first thing I saw. But the cougars are worth $13.50, so those are the best animals to go for when you're doing this to make it more profitable. Like I'm saying, I'm just kind of doing this for video's sake because I didn't have a lot of time. So once you've sold your animal to the cart to the butchers, you're going to want to call your horse back. You're going to notice that your animal is still on your horse. So you're just going to rinse and repeat this. You're going to go on over, park your horse once more. You hop off, you run back into the tailor, go right back into the wardrobe, wait until the settings pop up, and then exit. And you're going to want to wake your way back outside, and you're going to notice your carcass is still on the ground for you. Pick that thing up, sell it again, and you can just keep redoing this and redoing this, guys. This is an ultimate money glitch. There's no limit to this. You can do it for as long as you like. But anyways, guys, I really hope this helped you out. If it did, make sure you share, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.